Good morning, preschoolers. Welcome to the farm and neighborhood. We're gonna be having our Sunday morning services together today. And I have a question for you. Who can you follow? I can follow Jesus. So stay tuned and get ready to watch our Ollie story. And we'll see you soon. Bye.
today. I'm having such a great time playing the game that Manny and I created, Be the Leader. Can you guess who I am? You guessed it. I'm a soccer coach. I lead my team and help them practice. Today I'm setting up an obstacle course for them. Do you want to see it? Okay, great. So first we have to bounce the ball on our knees. Next I set up hoops for them to jump through. And last but not least, we have to kick the ball into the goal. Goal, yes! I can't wait for my soccer team to try out this obstacle course. Being the soccer coach is so great. Who, who? It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Who, who? Pretending to be a soccer coach, are you? I sure am. I'm having so much fun playing the game that Manny and I created, Be the Leader. Today, I am a soccer coach. I made an obstacle course for my soccer team. Leading a soccer team is fun. It's true. Today's story is about someone who leads everyone, even you. Just listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. I'm Aisha and welcome to my cupcake food truck. Now normally I make one special cupcake a day, but today I made everyone cupcakes. <laughs> Strawberry, chocolate, pumpkin, gluten-free, dairy-free, lemon, sprinkles. They are for everyone and anyone. <laughs> Which reminds me of a story. If you're ready for a story on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three, tell me a story. Today's true story from the Bible begins in a town with lots of people. There were kids playing together, people shopping, and friends talking to each other. But look, do you see the man in the middle? That's Matthew. Let's watch and see if anyone talks to him. Do you see anyone? Nope. There are lots of people, but no one is talking to him. That's because Matthew was a tax collector. That means his job was to collect money for the town from everyone. The problem was that tax collectors took more than they were supposed to, which meant nobody wanted to be their friend. One day, Jesus came to town. God's son, the most special leader ever, came to town. And guess who he talked to? Can you guess? Yes, <laughs> he talked to Matthew. Jesus went right up to Matthew and said, follow me. Do you think Matthew followed him? <laughs> yes, of course. Matthew got up and followed him because Jesus is the most special leader. The people who saw Jesus talk to Matthew were confused. They didn't know why Jesus wanted to be friends with a tax collector, but everyone can follow Jesus and be his friend. Later, Jesus was having dinner at Matthew's house and everyone was invited. And I mean everyone. Let's help them serve the food. Everyone gets a plate of food. Let's count how many people we can serve. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> Great job, guys. We served everyone who came to eat with Jesus at Matthew's house. And do you know why Jesus said to serve everyone? Because Jesus came so that everyone can follow him. 
even if you're like Matthew and made a bad choice. Jesus came for all the people. Everyone can follow Jesus. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Well, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who can you follow? I can follow Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can you follow? I can follow Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Bye. So there's your story. It's all true. Matthew followed Jesus, and everyone else can too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, what a great story. Jesus is a friend to everyone because everyone can follow Jesus. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Good! Hey, you know what? I want everyone to come and get to enjoy my soccer obstacle course. Not just the soccer team. I'm going to invite all the kids in my neighborhood to come check it out. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye! Come and follow me, Jesus said, Matthew 4, 19. One more time. Come and follow me, Jesus said, Matthew 4, 19.